Yeah, I'm sorry, but he didn't call you before carrying out the work. If you'd like to drop by, I'm happy to look over your bill. Wow, you even gave me a headache. Want to tell me what that was about? Putting food on your kid's table. By ripping him off? It's called creative accounting, Debbie. Well, you should have hung him first, not just stung him with it after. 200 nicker for 10 minutes' work. How much have you earned today? Did he mention to you that his brother-in-law works for trading standards? He's lying. No, that's you, Dad. You know what? I'm going to go home, have a nice long soak and a cold beer. Glad we're propping this place up. See you later. Point us out of business, more like. <laughs> oh, might have known you being on this. Get me involved. Oh, it's you. Oh, that sounds too enthusiastic, right. were you? Right. Well, sorry, I was expecting trading standards. Oh, will you stop mithering on? You're even more of a schoolgirl than he is. Well, just because I don't rip people off does not mean I wear a skirt. Right? Why are you that bothered about that bloke? He's a no-one. He's not a no-one. He's a paying customer, only he's paying too much. Yeah, but he doesn't know that, does I think he? he does, actually. He suspects it. That's different. Have you not learned anything? I have learned how to build up a business, one that you're intent on trashing. I increased your turnover. You increased my aggro. Listen, just because your life's falling apart, that does not give you the right to screw up mine. I'm going out. Oh, hang on, hang on, hang on. Where are we going? I'm going out. Well, not now, you're not. You're babysitting. Oh, and if I find out you're in on this, you'll be looking for a new job. That's if we've not been shut down anyway. Have a good night. It's a bit early in the day for that, isn't it? Do you know, I don't get you, Ryan. How's that, then? Well, I mean, you're a good-looking lad, but yet you're always in front of the telly picking your nose. Are you a little bit gay, love? I'm not a little... Do you know I've picked some gobby women? Hey, aren't you going to defend my honour? I do think you are, don't you? Have a good day. Come on! You in a rush or something? You babysitting tonight, are you? No, I mean... Seeing your new girlfriend. Not that your love life is any of my business, of course. No, it isn't. See you tomorrow. Wait! What are you doing Thursday night? Uh, dunno. Same as I do every night, go to the pub. A mate of mine is looking for a couple of cars. Thought I might go and do a wreck, you see what's about. You mean like last time, don't you? Easy money, if you're interested. Yeah, mate, we are meant to fix cars, yeah? Not nick them. All right, sorry, I forgot. You're a good little boy, aren't you? How's that going, by the way? Yeah, very well, thank you. So you're happy to get by in the pittance that our Debbie well, pays give me you. a pay rise, That's then. exactly what I am trying to do. Now, the offer's there. It's your choice. But it won't be for long. Morning. All right? Yep. Um, I've got some news. All right, well, just tell me while I eat cake, I'm running a bit late. Morning. Uh, OK, hi. They're all gone cos he wanted seconds. Fine. And I had the last of the bread. Sorry. I'll just get something from the shop at lunchtime. Well, I'd go myself, only it's a little bit awkward. No, no, you, you're fine, love. Look, I hope you don't mind us making ourselves at home, only I prefer it when guests get on with it rather than tiptoeing around trying to be polite. Easier all round, I reckon? Absolutely. Think you sleep well? Yeah, like babies, the pair of us, didn't we? Oh, come on, love. Eat up, otherwise that'll have been a waste. Uh, uh, how long are they staying for? But I could hardly stay at my sister's any longer, could I? You're more than welcome here, you know that. What she accused me of, I have got pride, you know. Of course you have. <sighs> the thing she said, I couldn't even go back now, she begged me. Well, no one's asking you to, are they? Thank you. You guys make yourselves at home. I just for a couple of nights, hey, Andy. And uh, I'll go to work. Yeah. She should be falling over herself to apologise and she acts like I owe her one. Yeah, well, she thinks if she behaves like that, people will forget who's actually in the wrong. Hiya. Hiya, just these please, love. Well, they do say that breakfast is the most important meal of the day. I wouldn't know. Your sister and a kid have eaten me out of the house now. They? They're with you? Should I not send anything? Oh, no, it's fine. Um, is he all right? Yeah, well, he hasn't lost his appetite, has he? <laughs> uh, just call it two quid. Oh, okay. oh and, um. Take that as well. That's his favourite. Peanut free. <laughs> okay. See you.